Hey guys, what's up? Anyway, no game video today. Instead, I'm gonna be reacting to this. Gordon Ramsay's ultimate grilled cheese sandwich, Ramsay's Around the World. Top tier chef, one of the best in the world. World renowned. And yet, from what I hear, he, he can't cook a grilled cheese correctly. Why am I reacting to this? I literally said to myself that I wouldn't react to these kind of videos, but yet, here I am. I'm gonna react to this disaster. Let's just get this over with. Full screen. Let's watch this. Oh my god, that's not. Hold on. Now, we all love grilled cheese. I grew up with it. That was cheese on toast. But. There's something quite amazing for a grilled cheese, especially when you have these what? incredible cheeses. The uh, Aramana with pepperberry and uh, Asiago. Bru beautiful. Bru really, really Who the beautiful. fuck eats these the kind of cheeses? I've never cheese. heard of those a day in my this life. This is a dream come true. No, it isn't. So I'm going to just cut nice big long slices Bruh. so I can take off the rind easily. Dude, who would eat okay. this kind of One cheese? Of is gonna make the like, cheese who would eat this in a sandwich? Look that looks there. dry as hell. I mean, does it even look so soft? Beautiful. That's not and beautiful. Get the fuck out of here. Asiago again, down. And literally cut off the rind. And then from there, get the slice and just go in half again. So you've got these nice, long. Luscious. That, this cheese looks Almost disgusting. Like sort of mini bricks of cheese. Now look at that. And that pepperberry is incredible. No, it isn't. Now the bread. The secret behind a great grilled cheese is to make sure the bread Bruh. is not too thin. I... Look at that. D the beautiful, locally. This, who eats sandwiches like bread. this? Like, it, this is a grilled cheese. What the fuck is this? What is this Bugatti bullshit kind From of sandwich there, you're trying to make butter. here? Okay. I don't butter Always my grilled cheese. I don't do that butter shit. heavily on the other side. You'll see why, especially when you get that nice, crispy texture. Dude, that is a Again, lot of butter. Crisp. Jesus Christ. Butter. Stop saying butter. Okay. It says butter. It season the outside. I don't season grilled cheeses either. And then from there, layer your cheese and sort of almost tailor make it in a way that it becomes somewhat almost Bruh, fitted this fucking donkey as he likes to call the people behind like this grilled dude. cheese is a little bit of kimchi homemade kimchi homemade kimchi ah yeah nice do y'all remember being texture. children one time, yeah, you remember cheese. putting kimchi on your fucking yeah. grilled cheese sandwich? Because I, I sure do. Kimchi. Not. Incredible. But once it's been cooked, breathtaking. You fold that over. Fucking idiot, Jesus Christ! There, push is, that down. What is this natural disaster of a sandwich? Jesus other. Christ! Look, a beautiful fireplace over there. Dude, get up fucking oven or something like what or get a toaster why you gotta use a fucking fireplace bruh it's not beautiful stop saying beautiful dude get the temperature up just lightly starting to smoke rest on the side push that down nice lift up and then she goes Now, as she cooks, uh -huh. start putting some weight on there. Dude, and that is so much down. butter. Th dude, that bread is so thick, it's not even melting the cheese. It's just melting the fucking toast. Oh my. I mean, it looks good, but for fuck's sake, you're messing. Dude, that cheese ain't melting. Push that down. That way it gets nice and crispy. <coughs> beautiful. It, that, stop saying Two beautiful. This is not beautiful. And this fucking sandwich sucks. Sides back out. And just place your spatula on top and push down. And that helps to get the cheese nicely melted. 
that is incredible. The kimchi with that incredible cheese, especially with that pepperberry. It's just gonna be a wonderful What the fuck is pepperberry? Also, I've never heard of that cheese a day in my flavor. life. What is it from that fucking Wisconsin or some shit? Like bruh. Cheese. What is yeah. this? What is this fucking yeah. sandwich? It's not melted! Look at this shit! Look at that fucking brick of cheese! It's, it's not even melted for fuck's sake. It's just covered in Pizza. grease! The cheese is melted. Oh my god, this sandwich is and awful. This. Yeah, how crispy that is. That's not a good thing. Beautiful. If it was melted, it wouldn't take that much effort to cut it. Oh my goodness me. That's not a grilled cheese. That's so that's not again. Why? 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 Why you gotta cut it in half? Man, look at this thing. Take a fucking bite out of that. Oh my god. No. That's incredible. No. That no. Pepper berry. Spicy. That's not how you make grilled cheese. The acidity cheese. of that kimchi and that bread cooked in the open fire. Dude. Dude. Wow. You couldn't have fucked this up any more so than what you could have. You know what I would have used? Me feel like uh, bro. I want to move oh, well, to no. Tasmania. Fuck this nah, place. It's delicious. Screw you. Go screw yourself. What the hell was that? Man, you know what I would have done? I would have just got Dave's Killer Bread from the supermarket. If you ever had that bread, it is amazing. I can tell you that much. Get American cheese or mozzarella or any stuff like that. Any cheese that melts really easy. Hell, use Munster cheese or Pepper Jack cheese if you wish. And just, you know, take that. I guess the butter, butter the toasting. That's not a bad idea. You take that. You put it. You do the same thing. You put it on the stove or whatever. But that cheese, however, the, the thing with bread that you get from, like, the supermarket and stuff, it's thin. It's not a thick loaf like what he did. Look look at this bread. Look look at this fucking bread. That is so thick, you ain't melting it. You can't melt the cheese that way. Like, dude, let me read the comment. Let's read some of the comments for a little bit before I head out and just go do some more shit. Let's see. People making fun of Gordon for simply doing... Wait. People making fun of Gordon for this... Simply do not understand how amazing of a chef he really is. It must take so much time and experience to burn a sandwich without even melting the cheese inside it. Truly impressive. Ah, yeah, totally. Gordon managed to burn the bread and somehow not melt the cheese. Truly a talented chef. Ah, yeah, totally. I would totally go to his restaurant. His fucking restaurant, they charge you $50 for a plate of food that's like the size of your freaking balls or some shit. I love how there's a perfectly normal stove in this kitchen where you can control the heat but Gordon decides to use a fireplace in the living room. Yeah, what a fucking moron. <laughs> I can't believe Gordon actually has the balls to post this. He knew damn well this ain't no fucking grilled cheese. Dude, you're right. <laughs> I love how we, we all are grilled cheese experts because it's the cheapest and easiest meal we've all, we've all have made. Yeah. I've eaten a lot of grilled cheeses in my time, and I can tell you, I could do it a thousand times better than this twat. <laughs> Man, what a great recipe. I love the contrast of the burnt toast and hard and not even melted cheese. Really breaking expectations like any good chef should. Judging by the zero dislikes this video has, people must agree with me about how great of a video this is. Ah, YouTube, you really fucked up by removing the dislikes. Jesus Christ. I just realized I have been doing grilled cheese sandwiches wrong for all these years. Every time I do it, the cheese melts. <laughs> for As a Swiss person, I can confirm his cheese license has been officially revoked. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I, th I think that's it. I think that, yeah, that's enough. Th all these comments, they just go ham on this fucking dude. Anyway, guys, don't make grilled cheeses like this. Jesus Christ. This... Just get just get some cheap, you know, sliced bread from the from the store. Freaking get some nice mozzarella, pepper jack cheese, American cheese, uh, freaking Munster cheese, all that stuff. Don't get kimchi. You don't need none of that shit. Just like you know, toast the bread, get the cheese. Well, actually, or maybe the, do the stove idea and put some butter on it, and then but you know. You could actually press down on it. There's other ways you could have toasted it. Don't use a fireplace. Use a fucking stove. Like, dude, you... First of all, who the fuck is going to have a fireplace where where you live? Unless, you know, you're a rich folk. You one of them rich folk or whatever. You... Mi 
fucking middle class where you can have fireplaces. Like, I'm poor as shit. I don't have any of that. Anyway, guys. I think... I'm gonna head out before this fucking video triggers me anymore than it already did. I'll see you guys around in the next one. Later.